Drag and drop through remote desktop connection. I use remote desktop on a daily basis and I find that I often need to quickly transfer files between my physical PC and the RDP, or even between different multiple remote sessions. I have network sharing enabled and I understand that it's not exactly slow transferring files by that means, but I'm looking for a way around that. I'm also aware that there is a copy slash paste option available if you enable local resource access to your disk drives. What I'm looking for is a direct, drag and drop. I heard that Microsoft was planning on enabling this feature with their new version of Windows Server however I'm having trouble finding any documentation. I run a dual monitor setup so this would be very helpful. My operating systems are Windows 7 Windows Server 2008 An RDP session is not a valid drag source in Windows, yet? So copy and paste is the fastest way. I usually hit Ctrl C and Ctrl V for copy and paste anyway, as personally I find it quicker than drag and drop, plus you don't get stuck waiting for imaginary transfers like when you copy something and then hit right click to try and paste it between sessions. Copying and pasting in and out of RDP is slower, transfer time wise, than copying via a VPN, share or FTP or HTTP, so I usually use one of those for large files, which keeps my cut and amp, paste available for other tasks while it's copying. Another option is VNC, including TypeMink, which is free, allows you to log into the desktop like RDP, and includes a file transfer button. A way to drag and drop local files to a remote server can be done as such. Have the remote server host its file explorer as a remote app. Share your local drive and map it on the remote server. Open the remote file explorer and navigate to your mapped local drive. Open the remote file explorer a second time and navigate to the remote server folder you need. Now you have two normal looking file explorers that can successfully drag and drop between each other without eating up the amount of screen space that an entire remote desktop session would take up. I have successfully tested this with Windows File Explorer hosted on Windows Server 2012 or 2 using built-in remote desktop services. I have also successfully tested this between Windows File Explorer and a third-party remote app both hosted on the same aforementioned system. FYI, I tested drag and drop between Direct Local File Explorer and Remote Server File Explorer as remote app with the aforementioned system. Still doesn't work. If you want to support the channel, please